welcome. Today we're going to prove that the sum of the first n odd numbers is equal to n squared. And now there are many ways to prove this, but I'm going to use the principle of strong lab induction, or PSMI. Um, I'll try to include the link because I, because I made a video of that before. Um, but like I said in that video, there are two steps. So um, step one is actually called the inductive basis. Uh, basically, n, I'm sorry, uh, yeah, n equals 1 in this case. So this rewritten is going to be like the sum of the odd numbers. So odd numbers are 2k minus 1 for 1 to n. Because actually, if you do replace it, you're going to realize this gives you 1. Um, if you replace k by 1, 2, 3 uh, of this sum, summation series, it's going to be 1, 3, 5, you know, so on and so forth. Um, and this equals n squared. We have to prove this. So for the step one inductive basis, um, that means for n equaling 1, the left-hand side equals summation of 1 to 1 of 2 times 1 minus 1, which is equal to 1, okay? Now the right-hand side equals n squared, which is 1 squared, equals 1. So since LHS equals RHS, um, that's good. So we did step one. Now... Step two is called inductive step. So basically, we assume that um, this is true. Summation of from 1 to n, 2k minus 1 equals n squared. We assume this is true. And we have to prove that it also holds true for n plus 1. So for n plus, every n in this case is replaced with n plus 1. So... 1, 2k minus 1. I'm sorry, this should be k equals um, for everywhere. Um, just the k is replaced by, you know, these numbers. Equals n plus 1 squared. So we were, we're actually going to take, let me move this. We're actually going to take the LHS, left-hand side. Uh, we have summation uh, from k equals 1 to n plus 1, 2k minus 1. Okay? And actually... Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to separate this into all the way from 1 to n, and then add on, since this is a summation series, we're going to add on um, the n plus 1 factor later on. So I'm just going to, it's going to make more sense when I write it down. So summation of k equals 1 to n, 2k minus 1, plus 2n plus 1 minus 1. So this is just, I, I hopefully... You guys get it. Um, this is just this plus the next part of the series, which is going to be for n plus 1. K is replaced by n plus 1. <laughs> okay, I hope that made sense. Um, so what we have next, we get n squared plus 2 n plus 1 minus 1. And n squared comes because of our assumption that... Um, Summation from 1 to n, 2k minus 1 equals 1. Uh, so, sorry, minus 1. Let me get this right. So since we assumed 2k minus 1 equals n squared, and we have the same thing over here, we're just going to replace that with n squared. And we're actually going to expand this out. Equals n squared plus 2n plus 2 minus 1 is equal to n squared plus 2n plus 1. And we get n plus 1 squared. Okay, that's your left-hand side. And your right-hand side is just, you know, it was n, n is supposed to replace n plus 1 squared. So actually, LHS equals RHS. And we got that. So since we proved step 1, and since we proved step 2, we thus prove that since the sum, uh, we prove that the sum of the first n odd numbers equals n squared. Uh, and that's just, that's it. We have to do two more steps. Um, if you do have any questions, I know this was a little bit complicated. Um, if you have do, do if you do have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. And yeah, a thumbs up and a like will always be appreciated. But uh, yeah, until next time, peace out.